resolution of those problems in the context of lifting uh, further uh, sanctions uh, down the road. So uh, that basically concludes what, uh, what I'd like to uh, say and just to repeat again uh, how wonderful it is uh, to be here and to be able to actually see you in person uh, after all these uh, years. And uh, with that, I'd be happy to uh, throw it open for whatever questions people may have. I just want to thank Senator McConnell for taking the trouble to come to see me, see if what is happening in Burma. And I have no doubt that he has the best interests of our country at heart. And that is why I trust his judgment. And I know that he will be watching the situation closely to find out what needs to be done. And uh, as a seasoned democratic politician, he will certainly be able to judge how far we are progressing along the road to democratization. So I think you can ask him all the questions you want to. I'll just stand by and listen. Well, I, I did leave out one thing. I will be meeting with the president tomorrow and look forward to our conversation and getting to meet, uh, to know him as well and to uh, get a chance to discuss the way forward uh, with him. To affirmative steps taken here and the, the steps that, we, that we're emphasizing that ought to be taken here first relate to the relationships between the government and ethnic uh, minorities. I mean, to the extent that we see those uh, other developments, for example, the ceasefire with the Koreans, other things like that, uh, would be an indication that we would reevaluate the appropriateness of continuing the sanctions that are currently in place. No, we, we will respond as we see improvements on these uh, various issues.